five ingredients, 10 calories, and it takes only two minutes to make. What's up guys, it's Max, owner of Max's Best Boot Camp, and today I'm gonna show you exactly how to make fat burning tea at home. It's so simple, and this is safe and effective to drink every day. So let's get right into the recipe, you guys. Now, as far as the base of this recipe, it is five ingredients. The first recipe is actually water, so I know you all have that at home. And then from there, it's a green tea base. So I actually have this awesome green tea. I just went to Tivana. I haven't been there in a while. This is not a sponsored video, but I got there. Emperor's Clouds and Mist. If you guys have ever been there, chime in in the comments below what your favorite tea is there. Um, but this is just a really awesome looking green tea. It's like these little pellets and it's so fra fragrant. But if you don't have whole leaf tea, you can use four tea bags. So I've got a few tea bags here. If that's your style and that's easier, that's what you have, use that four tea bags. And that's gonna be the recommended dose per day. So we're gonna make this concentrated batch right now. I'm using the whole leaf from Tivana. And we're gonna fill this uh, jar right up all the way, baby, all the way. Now, we're gonna probably leave this tea in here. I don't mind, uh, but it says to actually brew it for two minutes and then strain. But we want all the benefits from this baby, this fat burning tea. So we're gonna go ahead and leave it in there. Plus it looks cool, which is always a plus. Now fat burning tea, as this is steeping guys, let's just talk about is fat burning tea, uh, or is, is green tea a miracle? And there are so many health benefits to it. For fat loss specifically though, it's the polyphenol EGCG, which is really what the magic is behind the fat burning. Now, it's a powerful antioxidant, it will boost your metabolism, and it actually increases the body's ability to break down body fat. So the EGCG is really the key inside the green tea that gives it the fat burning properties. Now, there's actually a synergistic effect that happens with the green tea and the caffeine that's naturally, that naturally occurs in the green tea. And so together, that synergy is really going to boost the metabolism. And we're not talking like your metabolism is just gonna skyrocket, but between two and 5% is proven. Uh, so every little bit helps when we're on a fat loss plan. And caffeine also blunts the appetite, so therefore you may feel fuller longer and, uh, or you won't feel hungry and therefore possibly eat less calories. The other thing is the caffeine, it's great pre-workout. So if you're sipping on this, I want you to sip on this during the day, at work, on breaks, and then definitely before your workouts. Caffeine has this little extra heightens alertness, but also it allows us to work out at a higher level. And so the caffeine in there is a bonus. So this is steeping. This is actually looking really good. Let's get into our next ingredient in the five ingredient fat burning tea. We have the water, the green tea, and then the next ingredient is ginger. How beautiful is this root right here? And so I've got a couple of slices here. I'm just gonna dump that right in. Now, if you don't have the fresh root, which fresh is always best, so put a couple of slices in there, you can use a teaspoon of ground ginger that you have. But if it's like, you know, 10 years old, it's not gonna do anything for you except for maybe add a little bit of flavor. So fresh is always best, guys. Now, ginger is a warming herb. It actually has a thermogenic effect and it's going to raise our metabolism, our metabolic rate, actually two to 5% uh, through that warming process. So, hey, every little bit counts, right? So we're gonna let that sit uh, steep in there. Next ingredient, cinnamon. Now, cinnamon, I'm using these fresh sticks. We're gonna drop these right in there, guys. If you don't have the fresh, you're gonna use a teaspoon of the powder, but again, fresh is always best. And this is so fragrant already. It's amazing. So we're using the whole stick. Now cinnamon can actually regulate your body's blood sugar levels. And when our blood sugar levels are elevated, we tend to store the body fat and we hold on to it. So it's gonna allow us to have, regulate our blood sugar level and get into more of that fat burning mode much easier. The other thing is it slows the passing of food from our stomach to our intestines. 
So you're going to actually feel fuller longer if you sip on this before your meals. Uh, so another added bonus right there. And, you know, again, it's, it's not going to necessarily like burn calories, like foods don't burn calories necessarily, but if you feel fuller longer, theoretically, you're going to eat less at that meal. And then at the end of the day, at the end of the week, at the end of the month, you're in that deficit. And that's what really causes the fat loss. Good. Now, the last ingredient in this fat burning tea is lemons. And I've got a whole bunch of lemons here. Stock up on lemons, guys. Use fresh. Forget that bottled squeeze stuff. I've got half a lemon. That's what I want you to use in this recipe. So I'm going to add that in. I already, I already pre-squeezed. I squozed. <laughs> I don't know how to say that. Um, but anyway, and we're putting in, just, for, just to make it look pretty, we're adding in those slices uh, right in there. So there is the fat burning green tea right there. You're going to make this batch ahead of time, bring it to work with you, sip on it throughout the day. It actually is really delicious. As far as sweeteners, I'm not adding any into that. If you wanted to, stevia would be an okay option. Forget the honey. You're just adding calories. A lot of people ask me, Max, you know, what about adding honey? I heard that's like a miracle food too. And I think it's baloney, guys. You're just adding sugar. And when we're on a fat loss plan, any calories that we can kind of reduce that aren't doing much for us, go ahead and take those out. So honey, it's up to you. You can add whatever sweetener you want, but we're looking to really up the fat burning and create that daily deficit. So every calorie we add in should count and honey's just not one of them. So stevia will be a good option there or just hardcore like I did, adding nothing to it. Uh, and then as far as will this tea actually, just, just a real uh, heart to heart here, guys, if you're counting on this tea to just melt body fat and you're sitting on the couch after work and that's pretty much your activity level, it is not going to help you. So the best way that this tea, this fat burning tea is going to serve you is in combination with proper exercise plan, eating clean and overall caloric deficit. And so this tea will help you with that absolutely for sure so anyway if you guys are in the danbury connecticut area and you want to come train with us at the boot camp go ahead and fill out an application at our website at maxisbestbootcamp.com otherwise we'd love to see you guys here on the channel post any of your comments or questions in the comment section below we'd love to have you subscribe if you haven't already be sure to hit the thumbs up thank you for tuning in have an awesome day